This is Umar Ahmed for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. We're at the launch press conference for Zach Parker with Demetrius Andre, May 21st at Pride Park. Uh, has it sunk in what's happening, Neil Marsh? Yeah, you, you know, I've been about a long time now, so... Um, you, you, to say the the experience keeps you, keeps your feet on the ground. So, you know, of course it's sunk in, but, you know, I, I do have excitement for Zach. It's, it's a great day for him, so... Now, I know it was touched upon in the press conference, but for people who haven't seen, just want to address why Demetrius wasn't here today. Nothing sinister in it, but uh, his passport expired, so we couldn't make it here today. Yeah, you, you can read what you want into that. Um, we do believe Demetrius is a professional. I think he loves the, the bright lights, and uh, deservedly so. Um, but the fact that he didn't even have a passport ready it was probably his complacency that he thought the zone would uh, be putting the show on in America. And uh, unfortunately, that's not the case. Yeah, what do you think he's thinking about that coming to a way turf, Pride Park, Derby, it's going to be hostile, and also, yeah, a platform that hasn't fought on before on BT under Frank? Listen, he can, he can be as confident as he likes, um, but nobody's happy going away. Full stop, you know, let's, he's got huge aspirations of fighting Benavides and Canelos and different things, and um, he, he isn't happy. He's, you know, what do you think? You know, he cannot be happy coming to the UK to fight Zach Parker. It's not ideal, is it? It's not ideal. Well, it's not. I've I've been abroad 10, 12 times in my career, and unfortunately, I've only won 10% of the time. Well, a little bit more, you know. You, the win rate isn't, isn't like you are when you're at home. What I will say, though, is obviously Zach has the advantage with the size. Dimitris coming up to super middleweight. That is a big factor in this fight. As you said, Dimitris coming to, to Derby, not ideal at all. However, I think it's fair to say that this is a massive step up in class for Zach. Uh, would you concede that? Yeah, m million percent. I've got no doubt that um, it is a step up in class. But I've been with Zach six years. I know what he can do. And there's a lot of people on the circuit knows what he can do. You know, we've had, we've had him sparring overseas. We've had uh, decent names in the UK. And it all comes down to preparation. Um, I don't think Zach's had a second gear yet. And we're going to prepare him one million percent. You know, I've done a lot of camps for big fights. And we know exactly what Zach Parker needs. And he will be properly prepared for that night. So I'm, I'm, not, um, I'm not concerned about the, the levels they've boxed at. Because he'll be prepared at that level. What did you think about Demetrius saying you've seen nothing like this before? It talks cheap. Um, and he could say the same about what we're saying. But the only thing I think Demetrius has got is, is, is not the most pleasant style. Um, but again, it comes back to preparation. And by the time Zach Parker gets in that ring, he'll be sick of that style where he wants to take all his anger out on it. So, you know, you know, it's about how good your team is as, as well as what happens on the night and it's our job to get him properly prepared and we will do. And if that happens, he's properly prepared going into May 21st. Ultimately, you believe Zach Parker knocks out Demetrius Andre? Yeah, 100%, he'll knock him out. Um, you, you've been ringside enough times. When, when he punches and he connects, the opponents crumble. Now, Demetrius Andrade has been hurting off light middles. If, if Zach connects, he's, he's going. Um, got no doubt about it and a star's going to be born on that night and some of the viewers will question it at the moment and you're all entitled to your opinion and you know thanks for thanks for looking on our film and but just judge, judge us on our words after the fight because we didn't need to take this fight we could have let Frank give us a couple of more fights but we're ready we're, we're ready for this fight and you know just just tune in it's going to be a great night Frank believes that uh, the place will be sold out, 30 plus thousand. Uh, is that your ambition as well? Yeah, I, I don't think Frank said it would be sold out, but there is 33,000 seats. Uh, we have a very, very realistic uh, number. And I uh, spoke to the people at Derby, and uh, especially Angela, who's been fantastic. And uh, they've had a great first days in sales. So if anyone, I've seen a couple of comments, it might not do uh, 6,000, things like this. It's going really well, and fact, that they, no, no, I'm not going to say numbers, um, um, but it's going well for the first day, and uh, I want to thank all the Derby fans, and please get behind your boy because he's one of your own. There will be some atmosphere May 21st, and just to mention, well, this is important. Ten pounds from every ticket sold will be going to the club, and we know what Derby have gone through uh, recently, so that's a, a great touch. Oh, it's unbelievable um, on the meeting. 
Um, I can't remember if it was Zach or, or one of Frank's team. I think it was Zach who mentioned it, that if he's fighting a private part, let's put some money in. Uh, into a club, let's help him. Uh, me as a manager, I support Wigan Athletic. We've just been through it. Um, collectively as a team, we thought, what a great idea. You know, and, and it, it's the, cl the club are getting it for, for running costs. You know, there's no previous chairman's going to be getting all of the money, etc. The, the club's getting it for running costs. And what a, what a great, you know, gesture from Frank. Neil Marsh, thank you very much for talking to IFL TV. Best of luck uh, with Zach, May 21st. And also, we'll have a catch up about David Avenue soon, soon. All right, thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. Welcome, Team Everlast, to the Team Everlast Fitness Act. Download the Everlast Fitness app and find your greatness within.